So that's something. Uh, let's move on to Nintendo. I know Shipwreck, you're very excited about this next piece here. The 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 charging stand, the twenty dollars charging stand. You're excited that Nintendo put out an accessory that seemed to be priced reasonably. And- yeah, <laughs> that was surprising, right? Like, I they released the picture and I like clicked on it. And I'm like, oh gosh, how much is this thing gonna be? And it's it's only twenty dollars, but it comes with a catch. So this is this is just a little stand that you can like kind of adjust the kickstand on it and you can you can charge it which is nice you need to charge this thing because the batteries on them are not great um it doesn't come with a charging cable though it's just the stand oh, oh. yeah so certain usb3 or usb c um cables can charge the the switch so there, it's not like it's that expensive to go get one of those, hmm. but, and you can't use this as, like as a dock, like it's not going to be like output to your TV because it doesn't have HDMI. So it's just really a stand for you to charge it on, which I'm still interested in getting because I'm constantly looking to charge this thing and I have to, no matter where I'm at in my house, I have to walk it back downstairs to the basement to, to charge it. But yeah, that's lame. It's just weird that they... Why not charge twenty five dollars and put a cable in there? Right. It's it's just it's a strange business decision to constantly be leaving out power cables. <laughs> <laughs> That's the Nintendo way. <laughs> Speaking of the Nintendo way, mm-hmm. Nintendo uh, released some new details about Nintendo Online, which is coming in September. Um, they released a list of NES games that have. We're going to have updated features, I guess. Just online play? Is that the... Online play, and I'm, I, I'm sure you can, like, save save anywhere, probably, on them and stuff like that. I would okay. Hope. I don't know. Maybe I'm assuming too much. I think so. So everybody who wanted to play Balloon Fight over the internet... Again. So they, they've only announced 10 of the 20, but boy, is that an uninspiring list. Well, it's, you know, it's n- old Nintendo games. I mean, I have a Nintendo Mini, though, so whatever. Well, that's the thing, is that we we have all these. Yep. Nobody's looking uh, to play tennis and You know what's missing? A lot of things. Popeye. Popeye. You're not getting Popeye. I you know. know. What's the... Do- <laughs> I'm so... Lo- the thing that Licensing. honestly boggles me the most... Oh, I know why. It's like... Really, King Feature Syndicate? You're you're holding on to that? You're gonna play hardball with Nintendo? <laughs> right. Popeye is such a a well known franchise at this point in time. It's worth ba- Pe- basically nothing. Yeah, people are clamoring to get their hands on more Popeye memorabilia that you that you're gonna play hardball with Nintendo about putting this on the console. I, I I'm a little confused actually about this classic game thing. I thought they said they were gonna add like. It was going to be two different games a month. Did they change? They changed that. They oh, changed they did. That. Yeah, that was a while back. Okay, so now it's just going to be like a more of like a like here's a game bunch pass of games situation. Here's a bunch of games. Yeah, game pass for NES games. Yes. God, that's not an attractive. No, if it was like Super Nintendo games and Nintendo sixty four games, no, that it's, might be. It's, it's better, but it's not. It's still not GameCube games. Yeah. Eternal Darkness. Well, you're, if they were taking the best here. games from all these systems, that's one thing. How about, or even some of the indie games that are out now. I mean, it's not like Microsoft and PlayStation are giving those away every month. Why not do that on the Switch? All the games are there. Here's your Super Meat Boy. Go to town. Yeah, they're only getting 20 bucks a year for it. What do you expect? Or 35 if you do the Family Pass. And what's up with that? Are you going to be able to just share that with your friends? or Eight, eight people. Yes. I... Yeah, they, it doesn't have... Friends of the family that you choose. Really? No, I mean, you think they're just gonna let? No, <laughs> I'm like, what? No, no, no. I mean, I didn't make up the saying. No, no, no. I'm know? not talking about the <laughs> saying. I wasn't asking really about the saying. I mean, oh, what a car hole. I'm, I'm, <laughs> I'm asking: Is Nintendo really gonna allow eight people to divvy up a twenty dollar service? How would they know? Because. I don't know. There's ways to do it so you can yeah. limit it. No, I think I think people already 
plotting their course. I don't know. To only spend four dollars a year. <laughs> I don't think they're gonna let that happen. I think they're gonna want to hold on to that twenty dollars. I don't know. People want to play balloon fight as cheaply as possible. They they do indeed. It's not you know. And th- this does give you the ability to have online cloud saves now as well. All right. And to use that pretty sweet solution for that voice, voice chat. chat through your smartphone. Yeah. I, can't, yeah. I don't think I'm going to be paying these this $20 unless they come out. I, I, I know I won't be. Paying unless they come out with some amazing multiplayer game that I need to play Mar- like Mario hockey or something. But would that do it? I don't even think yeah. that would be enough. <laughs> I would love a, a great. I like those arcade Mario tie like like sure. Uh, I like ice hockey. Does the soccer I play one? Ice hockey with the fat guy and the skinny guy. Yeah, imagine how good that could be with in three. You know, with a real three D game like in the vein of uh, Superstar. What was the the soccer striker something? Yeah, I, I know Superstar Mario striker. That shit was awesome. Mm-hmm. Pay for that shit. <laughs> 